What's up, everybody? It's John John Smith. It's coming out to the brand new video. We got something really, really special today. You can see this big uh, kind of blister pack package here. It's by Vintage Sports Cards. And it's got uh, 12 baseball packs inside. Factory Seal packs. You've got um, Leaf on here. Um, series 2 from 1997. The Pinnacle 97 pack up the top. Um, this one's a hobby pack of Pinnacle. I'm not sure what year that's from. That might be 97 as well. You've got same club here from 98. I don't know what year the other packs are going to be inside, but there's 12 of them in here, I believe. Let's see what this side says. Inside is a trivia game for prizes. Yeah, 12 factory seal packs. Um, yeah, this is going to be fun. You could have bought this back in the day for $9.99. I paid a lot for this. Hopefully these, these packs don't stick. Uh, I bought this on eBay. Let's see if I can get this open somehow. So I'll just keep the camera rolling while I try to cut this plastic because this is... Uh, Gonna be a pain, I have a feeling. I'm trying to figure out where to go with it. Um, yeah, you gotta be careful with this stuff. It's like razor blades. Not my favorite uh, packages to try to open up or blister packs. They're not my favorite at all. You can see, like, almost anything may have just a piece of paper or cut, but plastic. There's the top off. Now, I did notice some notice some discoloration on the uh, on the package. Like you can see, this plastic here is a little brown. That could mean that it was near heat, or in a situation that might have had heat. I hope that um, that it doesn't affect the packs. Hopefully, they're not going to see a bunch of bricks in here, and I'll be crying at the end of this video. Hopefully, everything will be okay. Okay, put this up. All right, so here's this piece of paper here, Championship of Collection. Let's see what we got. Let's see what I can pull this out of here. That'd be nice, and I can rock on. Okay, there's also some sort of paperwork in here. What's this? This is a cool product. So far, <laughs> fingers crossed. Here's this. This is uh. Power play, a hockey trivia skills game, some sort of little ad insert. Um, that's cool. Troy Aikman card, Jack cards, variety. Of, oh, that's pretty neat. Uh, vintage value club points redemption catalog. Oh, this is cool to look at this off camera. Some interesting stuff there, some little literature. All right, let's see what the packs are. Okay, let's do the top one first. And we'll get opening these packs. So the first three, you got 97 leaf. Series 2, 98, Collector's Choice, um, collect, a, collect all four StarQuest insert sets. This is Series 1. Studio Club from 91, okay. Let's see what this side has. So Pinnacle from 97. Let's go Retail. Collector's Choice from 96. Action Pack Scouting Report. Uh, minor League Baseball Cards, okay. Collector's Choice is from 96. Look at the 99 cents back in the day. Let's see what this side has. 97 Pinnacle Hobby. Upper Deck Series 2 uh, from 95. Another 91 Studio. Okay, that's kind of a bummer. And then let's see what this side has. Stadium Club from 98. I kind of knew, I had a feeling this was going to be Collector's Choice or Upper Deck from uh, 1995. And then another Studio Club. My goodness. Okay. So only one, I think only one Toss product in here. Let's put this uh, over here. Get this over here. And let's get these packs open and see if we can pull anything cool out of here. Okay. To the studios first. Stadium Club. I'm just going to go. I don't even know what, how we're going to do these. We'll just do them um, in no particular order. 
Let's do these studio ones first and the discounting report. Okay, here we go. 91 Studio. Puzzles and cards. Which in Rock Group Puzzle, three puzzle pieces, 10 cards. Okay. Uh, this unique limited edition set features striking black and white photographs that capture the, the character intensity of 260 of today's top stars and rookies with profiles. With profiles that rise above the mere statistics to give you the insights into the personal side of baseball's most colorful players. Okay. It's a leaf product. All right, Hall of Fame Roberto Alomar. Let me tilt this down. There we go. Nice. Daryl Boston. Steve Avery, Dan Gladden. I don't know, did they say rookies on them? I'm not 100% sure. Uh, Ricky Jordan, Sean Dunstan, Dick Drabeck, Mariana Duncan, Dave Henderson, and Glenn Allen Hill. And there's a piece of a puzzle piece. A Hall of Famer in there. Back to you. See Mr. Carew. Tim McIntosh. Wade Boggs. Bill Landrum. Nice face. Chris Hammond. Gary Gaetti. Roberto Kelly. Greg Hibbard. Paul Ferris. Farius Oral Hershiser. Mike Benjamin. The puzzle piece. Okay, next pack. I didn't know what to expect with this product. It's so unique. I mean, there was only one of them. I probably paid way too much than, than what it, the value of it of these packs are. To me, I don't really care. It's fun. I mean, um, if you get something good out of it, it's good. To me, though, it's like I'm bringing something different to you guys. Something maybe you'll you'll, you'll dig and want to watch. Mo Vaughn, Jack Morris, Lance Parrish, The Wiz. That's a really cool shot. Love it. Ozzy Smith with the glove over his face. Daryl Kyle. Crime Dog for Emma Grip, Bob Ojita, Willie McGee, oh, Willie Speedster, uh, Mike Fitzgerald, and Lloyd Mosby. Okay, so there you go. A few Hall of Famers out of that. Let's pack so Let's do the scouting report one. I was hoping there was going to be more top stuff. When I saw that stadium club, I saw the year. I thought, oh, maybe there'll be some, like, really older packs. I, you know, um, some good stuff in there, like maybe some tops packs. 93 or something. So, okay, let's see. These are cool. We've got Derek, Derek Lee. Uh, they're embossed. Uh, we've, we have a bunch of football ones to open up. And these ones are from, um, what year is this one from? Does it say? Uh, it doesn't say. Let's, we'll look on the back, though. Hopefully I can read it if it's not too small of a print. But there's Derek Lee. They're embossed. We've opened these up before. I don't know if this is the year we opened up. Here's the back. It's from 94. This gold uh, foil type thing going on here. It's very glossy. Nice. These are nice cards. Johnny Damon. Yeah, we we'll get somebody good out of here. You never know. Mitre Cummings. Look at that, A Rod. We did open this this uh, box up before. That's a nice one. I don't really see any paper loss either. That's really sweet. Okay, we'll take that one. There isn't this Foxes Union on. I think there's Roberto Clemente. Yep, there's Roberto. And then we end with Action Pack, Franchise Gem, Chanho Park. So that's not bad at all. It was a very nice pack in here. Very happy with that. Um, got the nice A-Rod. Well, we did a whole video on this product, and we're hunting for A-Rod and for Jordan and um, trying to think who else. Oh, Jeter. Yeah, so maybe we'll get some Jeter cards out of here. Um, here we go. Collector's Choice from 96. This one's from 95. Let's do the 95 one first. And then Upper Deck. Uh, let's do Upper Deck first. I'm just trying to keep them kind of in order. This is Series 2 from 95. Predictor Baseball Game Card. Series 2 Upper Deck. Um, 10 cards per pack. Two Electric Diamond Insert Cards. So we'll get something good out of these. You never know. Let's cut this one. There's odds in the back, but let's just keep going. Foil wrapper. 
Okay. No sticking issues. Great. Okay, here we go. Jeff uh, King. What's the back of these look like? Dave Clark. Nice Nolan Ryan. Tribute card. Final tribute. That's very nice. Very nice card right there. Let's put that one aside. Here's the back of this one looks like, by the way. Very cool. Dave Hollins. I'm trying to think what these silver ones are. Those aren't the electric diamond ones, I don't believe. I think they say it on there. Sean Green. Steve Buscelli. Cold foil one. Howard Hojo, Howard Johnson. Benji Gill. Uh, Mike McFarlane. Hey, those are the, the ones. And then uh, Tony Clark. The star rookie. Star rookie, Tony Clark. Okay. I think these are the... I think these are the... Uh, kind of hard to read. But there you go with that pack. It was, I mean, interesting. Interesting cards. I thought a really nice Nolan Ryan. It's a very nice card. Okay. What do we got here? Collector's Choice Stadium Club. Leaf. Okay, let's do uh, this 95 one. This is um, Series 1. 99 cents back in the day. Okay, we have the Silver Auto. Uh, Major Cummings. Another one for Vaughn Eshelman. So a game piece of the play game. There is um, the big unit, Randy Johnson. Let's put him in the Hall of Fame pile. Okay, Tyler Green. Jaime Navarro. Butch Henry. Jeff Cirillo. The Dea Nomo Checklist. Nice Cal, a little ding down here. Um, when you get 20, 2131 games, right? Uh, his Iron Man status there is very cool. Uh, let's put him in the Hall of Fame pile as well. An international card here, Dennis Martinez, international flavor. Dennis Martinez, Nicaragua. Okay, interesting pack. Nice little Cal card out of that. All right, let's do this next one which is from Collector's Choice of 1995. And um, play you, you Crash the Game. It's a retail pack. 12 high-quality cards per pack. All new. Okay, away we go. Nice, Ryan Samer Rhino with a silver autograph. Dave Hollins. Garrett Anderson, rookie class. Juan Gon Gonzalez, home run champ. It's a very 90s vibe, these cards. <laughs> Dave Stewart giving you that look. Oh. I, he seems like a decent guy, though. I've seen interviews with him, and I just, you know, I seems the kind of guy I want to have a nice conversation with. He seems very, you know, highly intelligent, and so, uh, you know, it could be an interesting time talking. Greg Vaughn. I love that look. He's a really good pitcher. Mike Blowers. This Gary Sheffield. Um, he crashed the game July 5th. I guess you could, like, somehow sign up for that. To send it in. Three dollars. The internet was not. Even, I don't think the internet was even happening back then, was it? Ben McDonald, infancy stages. Maybe. Jim Essenreich, Mike Moore, and then we end with Scott Erickson. Okay, interesting pack. This Hall of Famer Ryan Sandberg card. Here's what these look like, by the way. I don't think we really looked that close. 
Very nice. Okay, let's keep rocking and rolling here. We'll do Stadium Club. We'll do Stadium Club. $19.98, $1.99, never compromise. The evens. And six cards. Miss Cal in the front. Okay, let's get this pack. I don't think I've ever opened a 98 pack of Stadium Club. I'm sure I'll recognize the cards once we get these open. Okay, Marquise Grissom, Transactions. Get the foil thing happening there. Nice, Wade Boggs. What is this one called? Expansion. Is this one you went to the Rays? Might be. Nice. Nice, A-Rod. Oh, that's cool. They all look like that? I guess they do. This one's... Oh, yeah, this is a regular, this is a regular base is my guess. It's still a very nice card. I'm going to put that in the highlight pile because I like it. Um, Transactions, Jim, Jim Loritz. Tony Saunders. Expansions to so the Devil Rays. Dante Powell. And then the checklist. Here's what the back of these look like. Did they do away with it? They used to put the rookie cards in the back. I don't know what year they stopped that. There's a checklist. 98 Stadium Club. I don't know. We'll look and see if there's any value to that. If it's something super expensive, maybe we'll look into that in the future. Okay, here is 97 Leaf Series 2. I don't think I've ever opened this before either. So Leaf Domrus and uh, eight cards in here. You could have bought this back in the day for $2.99. Three bucks. It was very expensive back then for certain products. I don't know what that would equate to now. Um, okay. I think I've seen this. I don't think we've ever opened these up before. Yeah, Ron Gant. Nice card. There's the back. Matt Williams Gamers. Benito Santiago. Darren Dalton. Oh, this is cool, Mini. He was the first, and so are we. Jackie Robinson, Dahmer's always true to the, um, that's like a little booklet thing. Oh, that's cool. I should have kept it closed, huh? That's cool. Don't miss your opportunity to own a piece of history or your limited edition Jackie Robinson lithograph today. $199. Number to 1000 I wonder if anyone bought these. That's pretty sweet. That was a pretty nice little thing to see. Uh, Kevin Seitzer, Terry Steinbach, uh, Chris Carpenter, and then we end with Julio Franco. So nothing super major out of that pack, but it's still an interesting... Uh, actually, that was Stadium Club. The Rodriguez. Okay, here we go. This is 1998 Series 1, Collector's Choice. Collect all four Star Quest insert sets. There's the kid, Ken Griffey Jr. There's nine cards per pack. I don't know if I missed anything. Okay. Well, Mondesi. This is the Star Quest card. A special delivery, it says. That was Star Quest. Dave Nielsen. Um. Jason Dick Dixon, rookie class here, Dennis Reyes. Masked Marauders, Yvonne Rodriguez. We'll insert card there, Hall of Famer. Mark McGuire. This All Star Game card. Steve Traxel, turn around, regular base. Top of the charts. The Kid and Andres Galarraga. RBIs. RBI leaders. 147 he had. And Galarraga 140. Here's a checklist from 98. Love that. Okay, two more packs to go. We're done. It's been fun. We'll do the hobby pack last. This is, I guess, the retail. Why is it black? I don't know. Could have, hopefully these won't stick. I think we'll be okay. Okay, um, I think that's 
it might be Aaron Jones or is that Ron Gantz on the front of the pack? Adam Jones. I said Aaron Jones. Adam Jones. Okay, Pinnacle. Snowpeck. These are wild. I've never seen these before. East means meets west. Gary Sheffield gets some uh, gets good and loose. Interesting. Insert. So Ricky Jordan, uh, Javier Lopez, Rico Bronya. Um, this is Alex Gonzalez. And uh, Ramon Martinez, rookie card here, Wendell McGee. Danny Nagel, and then we add with a nice Barry Bonds Aurora, or Aura, sorry, Aura. Interesting card, a little ding in the corner, but still, I'll put that one aside and showcase that. Right, let's see what the, uh, the hobby pack is like. Okay, here we go. We'll get something good out of this. Save the best for last, maybe. We'll find out. Okay. Uh, the Marlins, that's Charles Johnson. Actually, Davis. Aura of um, Alex Rodriguez. How young he looks there. Carlos Baerga. It's Rodriguez again. Nice. What year is this one? He's been around for what? A couple of years at this point, I'm guessing. It's a nice card. Um, Bobby Abreu, rookie card. Over the Astros. Put that one aside. Jim Edmonds. Um, this is Matt Williams. Hall of Famer. But I think a different kind of foil. Maybe not. Looks to be the same. Might be. No, it's the same. It's a base. Wangon Gonzalez and then Wangon uh, Aura. So there you go, guys. It was, this is interesting. No, no question about it. Um. I'm glad I was able to share this with you guys. It was worth taking the chance. So I was a little bit more pricey, more than what I would spend. I can't remember what I paid for this, but definitely more than $9.99. Um, let's just showcase some cards that we found in here. Let's do the Hall of Famers and some other nice highlights. Um, we got Matt Williams here. Um, leaves with the Indians. Von Rodriguez, Masked Marauders insert. Nice Wade Boggs. Expansion card from Stadium Club. Nice uh, silver silver auto, silver foil auto of Ryan Sandberg, Cal Ripken, um, Jr. for his uh, accomplishment there. This is a game piece. It said big unit on it in these studio clubs. Uh, Smith, Morris, Bogsy, and then Alomar, all Hall of Famers. That was the first few packs those came out of. The nice little, uh, little cards we found here that are pretty cool. Um, uh, some nice ones. I love these Aura cards. These are cool from Pinnacle. It's one gone. Nice A-Rod, early A-Rod card. Um, maybe a second or third year. Check. There's a, um, him. Look how young. I mean, um, there is an, an Aura card there. Nice Barry Bonds. Nice A-Rod. It's an A-Rod box. I mean, because he was like huge back then. So was Jeter. I'm surprised we didn't get anything from him. In these packs. Um, this one I really love. This nice little Ryan tribute. Final tribute. The uh, kind of gold foil happening here. Very nice card. I uh, love this nice uh, pro debut. Fourth anniversary. Uh, with Mr. Roberto Clemente. Hidden talent. It's like a, I think there's like a six card subset for this. This Channel Park franchise gem. Um, and then we got an A-Rod, uh, you know, prospect card 
I don't think they consider this a rookie card because it's not a rookie card. It's a prospect card. There's maybe a single A, the um, Appleton Foxes. But that's a nice one to get out of here. Very happy to be able to find this product. The um, I'm guessing this is from what were the new, what was the newest pack we had in here? There was one that was a newer one. I can't remember which one it was. Top of my head. Um, where did it go? Ninety-eight might have been the newest pack, right? I think that was. So the, this is this product is from ninety-eight, and um, but had packs in there from ninety-one, going back to ninety-one, ninety-seven. 95, 96, so, you know, the 90s. But there's Championship Collection Baseball Blister Pack uh, Package Baseball Cards. Very cool. That's all I got for you guys today. Have a nice weekend, everybody. Remember to like, subscribe, comment down below. Show us who your friends, family, loved ones. You basically link is down below in the description. That's all I got for you guys. Thanks again for watching, everybody. It's John John Sports Card signing off. We'll see you all soon.